I am who I am and I accept who I am. And so if I see a guy that I like and I know that he's eyeing me and I know that he's he he he's interested, but he doesn't know what to say because my my energy is it's very dominant. And so, you know, I'm I'm you know, I'm you know, <laughs> so I assert myself and when I assert myself, like I've had this happen. I'm just going to say on one, one or two occasions to where, you know, I'm conversing with the guy, you know, over the phone and like, and like he does or says, says things about other women, what other women do for him or what other women have done for him. And this is a manipulation tactic to try to get me to bend and do that as well. That's not how this works. That actually is a big ass turn off to me. Like, oh, you you want to screenshot your messages and send them to me about somebody saying this and saying that to you. Oh, they want to bring you lunch and they want to do this and oh, I'm gonna bring you the the worst one of the worst things somebody can do to me is is throw another person in my face. That's that's like that's a big no no for me because I don't compete. I'm not a woman. I'm of. I don't like to compete with anyone. Um, I. I just. I don't like it. Not a man or not a woman. I. I'm not in that type of. I saw this saying the other day. Uh, competition is lower level. We're not doing that. We. At the. We. 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 Um. What to say? At the top, we. We collaborating at the top. We're not competing. You know, and so I don't, I don't, if a man, if you feel like you want to make me compete with another woman, then you lost me already because I'm not going to do that. I will politely give you to her and move along about my business because I, I just, I don't do that. I, I don't do that. That, that, well, that's an emotional fuck. Like, no, I'm not going to let you emotionally manipulate me to bend and do what you want me to do because somebody else is doing it. Yeah, no, no, thank you. And the two people that I know of that do this have read the 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 the, the 48 Laws of Power and they throw it up like, oh, yeah, because I, I show them my book collection versus their book collection. <laughs> and it's like, OK, well. Yeah, we come from two different worlds. That's fine. You come from the material world. I come from the spiritual world. That's fine. It's two different worlds. But who says them worlds can't coexist together? You know, because, yeah, I'm a spiritual being, but I'm in the physical um, material realm. And I like nice things. I'm not head over heels for it. I won't do anything for it. I'm not a puppet. I'm not a slave. So I can live without all that fancy shit. But I like nice things. I like to go to nice restaurants. I like to eat. I like nice cars. I like, you know, I like what I like. And that's okay. I can have the best of both, both worlds. Why? Because I, I... I get I work for what I want. I don't expect everything to be handed to me. I know that I have to. I know that if I expect everything to be handed to me, I have to give something in order to receive you. It's a, it's a receiving and a giving type of thing, especially now in this world. Like the way men men the way men are using their power, it's sickening. It's it's um it's 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 sad because it's like y'all y'all already are dominant y'all already you know in a way i'm not gonna kind of i'm not gonna i'm gonna say this very 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 loosely because i feel as though i i am powerful than some men and that's just because and i'm not talking about physically because physically you were built to be stronger than me but when it comes to emotional balance and mental balance and spiritual balance I'm I'm strong. I'm strong in all of those um ways. And so I just I don't allow a man to assert a dominance over me to make me feel um any type of way. Any type of way at all. And I just I don't like certain traits, certain character traits that that people who actually read the book have and so I actually don't have any intentions of ever reading that book I'm not gonna lie to you um I feel as though that's manipulation that's not power 
Like, I, I, I consider myself real. I consider myself authentic. I, re- I consider myself powerful. Um, and therefore, therefore, certain things I find offensive. Um, and I find it to be, I, I, it turns me off. It turns me off and it makes me question your intentions. It, it, it makes me question like, okay, well, if you're bragging about this person or people, if this person is giving you everything that it is that you ask for, or that you um, desire, why are you not with them? Why are you not committed to them? Why? Because that's not what you want. You want them to give you what you want. And then you want to use that as um, receipts to manipulate another person to give you what you want to give the you what this person is giving you that's a sign of weakness to me um yeah that that's a sign of weakness to me that is not strength um that's manipulation i feel like if you can't tell someone the truth if you can't be truthful and honest with someone and then they they give you you know and that it's like that then i don't see any um use in it one thing that I am very aware of is that I am a source of energy. I am a source of good energy. And I cannot and I will not let anyone get charged or, or refilled off of me um, by manipulating me. I'm way, way, way too tapped in for that. Um, and I will not allow anyone to um, energy harvest off of me with manipulation and off of my emotions, off of making me feel some type of way. Um, I feel as though you can come correct. You can come in the way that you are supposed to come or you can keep that shit moving because I'm not in the mood. A lot of people like to portray themselves as source, especially um, with this 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 huge wave of spirituality that's going on, that's trending. Um, people like to portray themselves as as good as as a source of good energy, but you can see within the way that they speak, in the way in which they they talk about other people, in the way that they handle other people. All you have to do is listen and watch. It's very easy to tell a fraud from the real. To sell, to tell um, a higher vibration, a higher level um, being from a lower level being, all you have to do is pay attention. Mm-hmm. Most of the time, the frauds are the ones with the, with the knowledge. Um, if you've been following me, then you know that I strongly believe that knowledge comes from book and wisdom comes from experience. Um, a person can be book smart and be spiritually dumb as a motherfucker. Oh my God, I said that. Don't just be spiritually dumb, like, and 